Hey, hey, Spring Lafay, Simply Tarot. Okay, this is going to be a special message. Now, this is for the sign of Taurus. So, if you have Taurus in your birth chart, this could be a reading for you. All of my readings are timeless. Now, this one's a little bit different. Um, earlier today, I felt to do it this way. Past, present, future. So, for Taurus. Now, I've already shuffled. Past. Present. Present, please. Please show me the present. Hmm. Present. Future. Bottom, we've got lovers here. Please clarify the King of Swords. The King of Swords. Please clarify the King of Swords. High Priestess. Please clarify the Seven, seven of Pentacles. Someone's at a crossroads. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Please clarify the Eight of Swords. The Eight of Swords. Please clarify the Eight of Swords, please. Please clarify the Eight of Swords. Hierophant. Okay, either you were taking on the King of Swords energy. I feel like, though, honestly, I feel like this is, um, someone's dealing with, um, authority figure, authoritative, possibly a lawyer or a judge. You know, the King of Swords, a lot of times, that's what that stands for. <coughs> but, it's being clarified here with the High Priestess, so, you know, this is about, um, feel like guidance and I feel like it this person is guiding someone they're guiding them so this could be an authoritative figure of some sort then we have over here the seven of Pentacles which is about you know sowing a seed and nurturing it now we got the, the Two of Swords, which is about being at a crossroads and not, not seeing clearly. Okay, Three of Swords is pain. That's heartbreak. You know, then down here we've got, <laughs> with our um, Eight of Swords, you know, that's like being stuck, feeling stuck, but in all actuality, really not stuck. See, the bindings are very loose. She could get free at any moment. Nothing's holding her there. So someone is holding their holding them themselves in this spot. Hair font. Um, I, I need to just further something here. Okay. Huh. Okay, someone is dealing with either a soul connection or someone that they have known before when they were younger uh, because we've got the six of cups here. Now, this is someone, um, or six of cups here. Um, this is someone that, yeah, this, this is a connection. This feels like a connection. Very strong. Something ended. This something ended between someone. Um, the door. You see the doors burning. Someone ended something. And this is the knave of wands, though. Someone wanting to offer someone something. 
so I don't know you'll have to put this where it belongs but we do have like I said we do have strength here Strength is here because someone needs the strength to go, it feels like, towards someone. Yeah. See, there's sh this is strong. This is strong as crap. You see, it's like justice. Something, something's got to be balanced out. There was something left. It feels like left, not balanced. That's what I'm getting. Um, someone's really thinking hard about someone. This, See, this is love readings that I'm doing with these. Someone's thinking hard about someone. Lovers. Um, soul connection is what it feels like. Holding a seat open for someone. That's three of cups. Wanting to come back together with someone. Someone that's been, you know, it feels like someone's been watching someone somehow too. Because we've got that sword. But that's also about truth. A need to stand in, in one's truth, you know. Uh, someone's really been thinking very hard about someone. That's what I'm getting with this. Because they're in love with them. Ten of Cups. But, some of those cups are turned up. I feel like someone didn't show someone um, just how much they love them. Or something like that. Um, but we have the Six of Pentacles here. This feels like someone wanting to, um, oh, it's the universe. The universe is off, is, is, it's like gifting someone something. Beautiful. That's beautiful. See, we got lovers again. This is a strong soul connection is what it feels like. You know, strength. That's about strength. A, a strong new beginning. A strong. Someone wants a strong new beginning. They want to work on something with someone. With their person. To bring balance back. For a clear path. I'm drawn to the path. Sorry about the dogs barking. Like somebody. Something outside the dog. has got the dog in an uproar or something. We got the world card here, but something's ending. Something is ending for one or both of these people. Oh my goodness. This is flipping unreal right here. I'm going to show you. But this is thinking. Someone really thinking hard, but look. They give us both of them. Both decks. Look at that. The Queen of Pentacles. You know, this is someone that's very loving. Very, uh caring, mothering, nurturing. That's one of our people. This is beautiful. It really is, but someone's got to have the strength to go forward. They they really do because it feels like they're not doing it and you know, everybody has free will. And you know, yeah. Oh my goodness. Too many. These don't belong. Okay. Is someone, it's like someone separated from someone. See, we got separation. Time apart from your partners on the horizon. It feels like it's already here. Um, because I'm drawn to just the way they, they look like they're so separate. We got a lot of cards here. I think they did this the last time on Taurus, but I'm not sure. This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. So, you know, I do feel like for some of you that is a soul connection. And I am putting them right here at our little glass thingy that says, let me show you what it says. It says, see that? Our love will last forever. That's what it says. It's a pretty little thing. Uh, I figure it worked really good for the readings for this. You know, for these romantic cards. Because it is beautiful. But, we also have heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with, with each other. And, it is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. And then we have, on the bottom... 
soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. So someone is dealing with a soulmate connection. Um, if you don't believe in that, then it's a very strong connection. Magnetic. But um, that's what I have for you. If this isn't for you, just leave it. Just leave it. And uh, thank you so much for joining me. Let me just start out another one. That one doesn't belong. Um, Till next time.